going to go in and do the shadows on the Roma Tomato. There's a few more on this because it doesn't have as much light hitting it by the apple, plus the apple is blocking some of the light. I did a little dent in my tomato here, which means it's time to eat it. So I'm going to work on that, leaving some light spaces because the little dent in this tomato catches the light differently. There's a shadow up here. I just want to go very light and be very sensitive with my drawing. It's harder to go lighter once you've laid down the lead. You can only erase so much. So start out lighter and go darker. You can always darken up a shadow. You can only lighten it so much. There's kind of a big shadow here on this tomato. We've just outlined some of the basic shadows in our apple and in our tomato. I feel like I missed some, but we can always go back in as we add more value. Next, we're going to anchor these to the table by doing our shadows.